Hello guys, good morning. Today is our seventh day of our quarantine. We woke up so early this morning around 4.48 because I feel like the bed was shaking so hard. And then it, I realized that it was an earthquake. Oh my, it's been a while that I did not experience that strong. I feel like that was about like seven magnitude. I'm not so sure but it was strong but i think there's no damage so far that we've known i heard the hinges of our bed the building was shaking so bad and then we get up we don't know what we, what we're gonna do it was a little bit crowded but i was really thinking like where did i put all the passport and all the documents the, the important documents and so thinking was all Wolfram was also thinking that she, he's gonna carry Zarlo outside, but you know, we're okay. <laughs> we're okay, it didn't happen. We were just having a plan what to do if, if we really get worse. But anyway, since we woke up early, we were not able to go back to sleep, and we still thankful that we are still here and no damage happened in our hotel and also our surroundings and so far i did not hear anybody that was uh, injured during the earthquake and today is sabbath day or our seventh day of quarantine we are still waiting for our swab test i don't know what time are they gonna come but we have so many blessings today in spite of those uh very early crowd like panicking during the earthquake we have hot pandesal this morning thank you big boss hot pandesal for a very delicious pandesal they have cheese desal and ubi desal and shout out to jure for also dropping us some cinnamon from manila sanitarium um it was also delicious thank you so much for um for dropping up some food here but we have we were also happy this morning because at least there is a change of uh food we don't have chicken this morning we have corned beef and egg yay <laughs> we're happy to see it so for the meantime we will do our worship we our morning worship and then we will update you for the rest of the day for our swab test. Please pray for us that we could get a negative PCR result. I mean, we are okay. We don't feel sick at this time. We are praying that everything will be, will run smoothly so we can go to Davao on Tuesday. And that's it. And see you later. <laughs> Exactly 11.30 in the morning, someone called us here in the room and informed us that it's time for us to go out to the lobby to do our swab test. Yay! The most awaited moment of this quarantine is this swabbing. And we have to wear our face shield and mask when we go out there in the lobby. So, what are we gonna do now? Tara na! Magpa-swab na ta! Okay guys, this is really crazy. And I did not expect that the swabbing here is your mouth and your nose. All I know is they're gonna do it in your either your mouth or your nose. But here you have to do both. I don't know what is that all about. So we asked the nurse. The nurse said that... Um, their lab that the toxic care laboratory agency will do the other test and the red cross will will also do the other test like the other sample i'm like okay how many times do you need to do um test to run the test for one person this is just ridiculous for me to be honest with you i did it so many times to my patients but i only did it um in the nose and there's no problem with that that's probably why this takes so long 
because they have so many process and it's useless process they don't need it it's not like it's useless it's unnecessary okay that's the right word unnecessary procedures but anyway there is nothing i can do with that i'm just saying that there are a lot of unnecessary procedures here and that they need to eliminate they need to look it up to because you know it's a waste of money that's probably why it's too expensive that we have to pay that much because they have to do to run two agency is that because they don't have um trust with the other agency the the toxic care that's why red cross is also doing it mm, if you don't have trust with an agency why would you let them do it okay so just heads up for you guys if you are doing your swabbing expect for mouth and nose and i didn't really expect that all right that's it for today and please please pray for us we need our results to be negative and we are expecting that to um to come out on monday so we can go to Davo on tuesday see you guys soon bye Thank you.